This while I was sitting down, so. Well, that's the end of your job. Camp Jazz! Yay! <laughs> Who's been to Camp Jazz before? A little cockroach. So, the aim is to get everybody else here. There, next time. Is it Sydney this year? <laughs> it's great weather that we had there. It was on an island, which is the, the theme of the website. Well, it wasn't actually an island, it was actually just somewhere that was only accessible by boat. Correct. So it felt like an island. And it anyway. wasn't far from that, that place there. We did have some, I, didn't, so you I couldn't find the photo, but there was one of the bigger boats ended up in a creek. Um, so you had to be fun. ferried over that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, was, it was great. Is that the boat in the water? Here's, here's <laughs> the one of the boats that actually came in. So uh, just to give you a quick rundown of what happens at Camp JS, we're not always on boats. Usually it's on land only. Uh, come in Friday afternoon, Friday, start, People just maybe like to start hacking stuff, play games at night, give a quick intro. Saturday, talks and workshops. There's like some sort of, the Matt McKeg did some cool like web audio stuff while like Hugh did some cool like visualizations and things. It's the Camp Jazz dance party, let's say that one. Pretty much. Yeah. And then more games. Up? Did anybody stand up during that part? Or? There was a couple of like people grooving down. Yeah. It was uh, interesting. It was a tall dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, those people. Uh, and then Sunday more talks, workshops, and things like that. And then demos of what everyone had done. There's and then JavaScript developers, look at them all. I know, and games, again. And then Monday was leaving again, which slightly better weather than over the weekend, but still a little bit rough. Um, so back, like just in here, out of frame would have been like where the boat was in the creek. <laughs> <laughs> so just to go to some highlights this time compared to, it was a little bit different. I'm not, I've mostly only gone to the Gold Coast ones, um, but, and haven't been able to make a Melbourne, but obviously werewolf is always a highlight. That's Ooh. pretty much, pretty much could just be called well, like camp werewolf instead of camp bears. But anyway, this time network slash offline was actually the best it's ever been. They had a, uh, Total, and you could pretty much get anything off NPM, like on the local network, which is amazing. They were using patchwork for peer-to-peer, -peer, like social networking stuff, which was pretty cool. Um, if you can re read that, that was um, Hal asking people if they had toothpaste or soap. <laughs> <laughs> he actually breathed it. <laughs> uh, no, it's Hal. It's, yeah. It's, uh, what was the other thing that they had? Oh, it was like uh, sort of sort of file sharing for like peer to peer stuff like over the web browser, mm. which is cool. Um, diverse in terms of like, there was actually probably the most women there that we've ever had. Yep. Um, also talks wise, it wasn't like in the past, we've kind of been like oh, very much like virtual reality or something that was like a very like common, there's a lot of common topics. It was like all the talks are pretty sort of diverse. There's lots of different stuff happening, which was cool. Um, there wasn't as many workshops, it was more talk based as normal, and we just got on the Sunday because we kind of all just, the weather was so bad we didn't even actually go to the other rooms, we were just like, everyone is talking here. <laughs> so, the turkeys, so you had to watch your food outside. <laughs> um, the venue, this is on the Friday obviously, 
actually on the other days you didn't really want to go outside but <laughs> it was it was nice there was a beach and there was like a little areas like there's even a pool which we never want to use coffee was better than we've ever had it's yeah. great yeah so oh. that, that was um oh. yeah every every day we had coffee or most most of the day which is awesome very good coffee too obviously just packings was good we had beanies for merch which was cool mm. we thought we were going to get a fire but the actual venue had like an indoor fireplace which in the main workshop venue so which is really cool there's high ceilings and things and it was going the whole time it was it was it was great um no more byo this time last time it was like byo drinks so this is us bringing it over on the barge. This is us after we drunk it. <laughs> I had a sweet room, just in case there was like a teacher's room. I got like, it was basically like a hotel room. It was awesome. Kirbytron was a thing. That was like a network game that everyone played. One of my favorite but lots of people played. It was fun. Gary bought a phone. It's awesome. Yeah, bye. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> Next game, we apparently they know the country, but I don't know the country yet. But I think it might be either, you know, hint it could be over the ditch. Yeah, well, I'm not sure they they were hinting at potentially New Zealand, but originally it was meant, meant to be like Malaysia or Singapore or something. So it would Singapore, be Singapore, Singapore, but I don't think he's ready to do it yet. Yeah, that's what I'm, mm -hmm. yeah. I don't know. Well, I know Sharky reckons it's he knows the country, but he doesn't know the place. So that makes me think that. Potentially New Zealand, but yeah. New Zealand perhaps Wellington, perhaps Christchurch. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But anyway, if you want to keep up to date with what might be happening, if you are not on the resource Slack channel, this is where you would get your magical invite, and it's a great place anyway, just to really to keep up with. There's like a JavaScript channel there, so there's a jobs channel there. Just just for those that are yeah. interested. So um, mostly not about jobs. <laughs> probably not. No. Yeah. Anyway, that's the place where a lot of the talk happens. If you want to keep up to date with the next one, so yeah, see you next time if you can go. Thank you very much. Fantastic. Yes, we didn't return to Well, I put it on too much. <laughs> Thank you. There we go. All right, well, that brings us to the conclusion of our evening. Uh, thank you very much for staying back and hearing all the shout outs and all the interesting topics. Thanks very much for producing that little wrap up for us at the last minute because we know that was bam, getting slides done there and then. Um, thanks all for coming. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, remember to get back in touch with me if you've got more topics, if you want some more presentations. Thanks again for the drinks, JDP. Shout out again. Okay, awesome. Um, we'll see you guys here uh, in July, first week of July. So um, hopefully we can, uh, we already have two talk submissions, so I got in early on that, so, so that's excellent. Thanks very much for everyone's uh, contribution. But if you've got more ideas, you've got more talk submissions, the Meetup Issues place is the place to go. Otherwise, just get in, in touch with me and I'll put it in there. Um, Corey, looks like he has something to say. Oh, we have Ah uh, yes, we will have drinks too before that. We will have the uh, the regular pub meetup. So Ash Kid will be in touch with that one, and um, that way we can just uh, get together and chat. Thanks very much, everyone. See you next time.